Streamline approval processes with Smartsheet automated workflows. You can add an approval request to an existing workflow or create a new workflow from scratch. Your workflow will always begin with a trigger, which tells Smartsheet whether to run the workflow on specific dates or when certain information in your sheet changes. After picking the trigger, you can set up your approval request. First, enter an individual approver, or select a contact column to ensure the appropriate person is contacted for each request. You can send approval requests to anyone with a valid email address. By default, Smartsheet will create a new column for the approval status, but you have the option to choose an existing column instead. If you choose an existing column, you'll need to tell Smartsheet to map the approval status to the values in that column. You can also change what text the approver sees on the Approve and Decline buttons. Provide the approver with context for making their decision. Select which columns to include in the request and add a subject line and message. If you expect that an approver will receive many requests, you can bundle them on an hourly, daily, or weekly basis to reduce the number of notifications. Approval requests are mobile ready, so stakeholders can respond on any device. The approval status column will tell you when a request has been sent and also record the approver's decision. After configuring an approval request in your workflow, you can use it to trigger other actions. For instance, send an alert to the requester when the request is approved and request more information when it's declined. You can even set up a multi-approval process by creating a chain of sequential approval requests. And that's how to use approval requests in Smartsheet Automated Workflows.